Hello friends, welcome. I am showing you step by step how to make a one stroke flower painting. For this painting I am using colors white, dark green, light green, ultramarine blue and uh, raw umber. So first step I am mixing raw umber and ultramarine blue along with white to create a grey color for this flower. So as you can see there is light grey. and you mix it very well you can add some water if you want and then using a quarter inch size flat angled brush dip the bottom portion in gray and top portion in white and then gently make a stroke like a petal so it has a mix of both white and gray so just like that keep making strokes gently and in between you can wash the brush and wipe it so it will be clean so after making few petals I wash my brush and then I wipe it off with paper towel and then again carry on so you can make all the petals like that and you can turn the canvas around if you want and I forgot to tell you this is the canvas I'm using black canvas about uh, 9 inches by 12 inches and if this is your first time coming to my channel please subscribe I post videos every single day I'm giving five finishing touches for these petals look at that how beautiful it is and I'm drawing another small bud in a similar way and then I keep making other flowers in the same manner one more bud over there and then I'm wiping it off my brush and again loading it with a new color do the same strokes like we did for the first flower the reason I'm washing and wiping my brush in between is that otherwise the colors get mixed up on my brush so I want my brush to be clean so that's the reason I am wiping it off with paper towel and let's make a big flower this time slightly bigger And I turn the canvas around because it's easier for me to make the strokes but if you are comfortable with not turning that's okay too because I like to turn the canvas see you look at that how beautiful it is really nice and I'm happy with my flowers so far so now let's make some leaves I mix dark green and light green and in a similar way the top portion I mixed with the light green and bottom portion dark green and gently make a leaf like that the reason I'm making the top portion lighter is because this is a black canvas so lighter color outline will be good that's why I'm just choosing the lighter color for the outline and one stroke flowers are really fun to make because it's easy and also it gives a great satisfaction when you make the painting and in fact I'm addicted to uh, making this one stroke flower painting it's so calming to make and I really enjoy so I drew a center line also let's make another leaf like that and you can make the leaves in different shapes also 
not necessarily everything in one size and the same shape. The color combination that I chose, I think I really like it because it's a very beautiful color combination of greens. The dark green I used uh, yellow green and the light green is uh, the yellow green actually. So that's the exact color I used. And now let's draw the stems. Just a free hand drawing of stems. Make sure every flower is attached to the stem. And one more. See, look at that, how quickly we made this flower. I, uh, I did the speed video, but still, I didn't take that long to make this painting. Hardly 20 minutes or so. So adding few more leaves. I hope you are enjoying uh, my uh, painting so far. And uh, feel free to comment on my video if you like me to make any other flowers or any other painting that you want me to make a tutorial. I will be very happy to do so. We are almost done. And I can't wait to make another flower painting with a different color. I'll uh, be back with another tutorial with some other kind of flowers. And it's really addictive to make this one stroke painting. first couple of times it'll be hard but once you get the hang of it it's really easy not that hard next time I'm going to make a different kind of flower and different kind of leaf so please subscribe to my channel because I like making art tutorials every day And adding one more layer of some white white and gray petals so it gives a three-dimensional effect you know if you add a second layer it gives the clustered three-dimensional effect to the painting and now for the center of the flower I'm using yellow bright yellow and also yellow ochre so let's uh, make some dots with the back side of the brush I use the back side because it's easy for me to make dots using the back side of the brush. So we add a little bit of both colors, bright yellow as well as yellow ochre. And see so beautiful it is. Really nice flower, I like it. No, I should say I love it, not just like. <laughs> So this adding these dots it creates a 3d effect that you can see because they, I am adding thick dots with the back side of the brush and we are almost done and just wanted to remind you please subscribe and click the notification bell icon on my channel so you can watch all my videos and refer your friends or family to watch my art tutorials so it's really beautiful flower we are almost done look at that wow really